Welcome back sports fans for another episode Inside the Thunderdome. I'm your host, Big Ben MTG. Catch me live at twitch.tv. Hope you enjoy today's content. Oh, this morning we're playing some Isadelver. Uh, we're playing a bunch of 18 lands, 27 um, one drops in four Brainstorm, four Delver, four Ponder, Reordain, four Scary Terries. Bunch of spell pierces, some stifles, and then a bunch of red burn spells. Creature packages, the Delver, Young Pyros, uh, and True Names, and the, and the Scary Terries. And we're playing our blue counter suite. And that's it. In the sideboard, we've got some mostly red sideboard cards. Let's get it. If, uh, actually, a couple clients and, and the rest of the team together. Got, went out to um, Signal Brewery and we had a couple, couple of beers there, a couple of man sodas to celebrate. A lot of fun. Um, we'll grab a Valk here. Switch the teamer to top. Switch the teamer top like champion. <laughs> I sound rough, yeah. <laughs> it was uh, it was not easy, man. It was not easy. And I, I don't recover the same way. Two days later. It's not easy. <laughs> Green for golf is all you need. That's true, you just need that clock, man. All about it. Let's see what we get here. Chain lightning. Yes, I do. Bang. Um. We swinging for three here. I think this deck is going to be up my alley in Legacy. It's just the perfect amount of... I'm starting to really like decks where... Oh, is this Karn? Oh, show and tell? Uh-oh. Well, I'll try and counter it. Um. Delver Axe is, is best would always first pick. I think you're right. Got the force. Uh, is this Omniscience or just Emrakul? Oh yeah, I get to put in... Put in Young Pyro. It's Omniscience. And Grizzlebrand, there's... Not a lot of ways that I win this. I'm gonna take a look at that soon, Josh. Ugh. Um, bring in our blast and Um, I think if I want sulfuric vortex in here. Excuse me, sorry guys. I definitely want to finish the game quickly. I don't want to win a counter war. So all the forces are going to be good. Stifle. Stifle's probably fine. Um. Might just be out on these two. And maybe, uh. Daisy's gonna be tough to convert with as well. That's good. Uh, this hand is quite good. 
Does not have a threat. One of tire, tire fire. <laughs> um. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna draw the threat. Yeah, it's true. It's true. I'm, I'm into it. I don't mind this. You're definitely the aggressive deck. Um, it's fine. Put two cards on top. <laughs> um. Brainstorm here, put land, land back. Well, this is gonna be tough if we do not get a land, it's for sure. Or get a land, get a, a creature. I will, buddy. I'm gonna take a look as soon as this this game's done. Ooh, all right. Got our threat. Wanted that one. Not you, bad. <laughs> it kind of feels like it is because everyone's here to see a stream about with just me on it. We are still in Mortal Kombat land that Alex made us planeswalk to. Anybody else have any ideas for planeswalking? Hit me up with the channel points. Thank you all. <laughs> Pieces of the puzzle. Um, sure. Revealed. Omniscience, he gets two instant or sorcery, so he can't take Omniscience, Emrakul. What did he take? Beardane, Emrakul, and Omniscience in the graveyard. Took pieces and Brainstorm. The old blind flip. And Lightning, again, there's only one in the deck. We've Revealed it twice <laughs> to that. <laughs> Three more. Pyroclasm deals three damage to each, or two damage to each creature. Um, yeah, that sucks. That looks fine, most, uh, maybe more refined side, maybe cut tree top for fast land, ooh. Uh, I play Ractor Shadow, never hard to get low. Night's Whisper and maybe seconds. Night's Whisper is actually, I've been very impressed with. As a card. Another pieces, sure. Revealed. Well, they got the show and tell. So you put Emrakul, Brainstorm, Polluted Delta. Okay, so they got show and tell and force the will off that. That's pretty good.
All we have now is a bunch of counter spells. Nice whisper, shockingly good, and it is very good. I'm I've been very impressed with it. There once was a ship that put to sea. The name of the ship was the Billy Oti. The winds blew harder, bowed him down below me. Bully boys blow. Soon may the weathermen come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue is done, we'll take our leave and go. She'd not been two weeks from shore when down on her a right whale bore. The captain called all hands and swore he'd take that. All right, let's see what we can do. Carpet of flowers. The weathermen come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue is done, we'll take our leave and go. This thing makes so much mana, which makes spell piercing days just miserable. So, just probably um do I counter this tight once more our boats were lost there were only four and still that whale did go soon may the weathermen come to bring us sugar and tea and rum one day when the tongue is done we'll take our leave and go as far as i've heard the fight's still on the line's not cut and the whale's not gone the weatherman makes his regular impulse okay In the brainstorm, they get off the impulse. Oh, it doesn't. God, carpet flowers is so good. Well, it's not bad. Still need them to take some damage off of this. Ponder. They're digging hard. Are they just missing a threat? Because they have the show and tell in hand. He's shuffled. Um, okay, so now we're going to fight. Let's see what we do here. Um... They probably very likely have a daze at some point. I can't imagine this is their last or a daze of Veil Summer, sorry. Alright. Let's see who they got. A lot of counter magic. Instant card for most of the game. Put in your hand. Jesus. <laughs> oh, got him to two. It's more learning to do, but the uh, no threat, I think, was an issue. Uh, I'll keep this one though. He did go forever. Like, I don't know what turn that was. Eight? Seven, eight? Something like that? It was way too long. Yeah, uh, yeah, that makes sense too. Uh, I'll just play Snow Covered Island here. And the Delver. I'll protect this. I've been playing so much Pioneer, I thought this was Fabled Passage, and I got so excited about it. <laughs> I 
Ice Whisper is really solid. You, you gotta try it. Maybe blind flip off of Chain Lightning again. Days. I'll take it. Playing Lurus Bobble is the card draw. I think you still do the same thing. Nice Whisper is a nice way to lose some life. Green, blue, Sylvan Library. Well, I'm not gonna let that one resolve, so we'll spell pierce it. Play around days. Bolt them, scary Terry. Here we go. This thing becomes a three three, right? No, oh, five five, sorry. Another Sylvan Library. Um That's actually fine at this point. Another days hit for four. This is gonna make them look, but they're not gonna get to. If they take a card, they'll be pretty well dead. If you're talking about loving. Against walkers like Leon and Jace. I do really like um, Treetop a lot. Like, it's probably. I think Mutavault is actually the strongest um, land, man, man land, but uh, Treetop's right there too. Trample is, is huge. Deck is fine, was just cutting off maybes for sure cards. Like, things that are better. More often. Yeah, I agree. Um, I'll put these in. And I think that's about it. So these are going to come out for, again, stifles. And... Maybe one Pyro? One Terry, I think. Um, Walker, we are playing against... <clears throat> All I've seen is blue, green, and Sylvan Library, so I'm not exactly sure what they've got left. Can you pick it off from... From what that is. Blue green. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Could could very well be then. <laughs> Did see a preordain, yep. That makes this makes sense as well too. That makes that makes sense for the beside you. Thank you. Appreciate you. Um, I think I want to get rid of this right now. So that I don't get Omni this turn. I don't get show and tell this turn. Seven mana traverse for Grave Titan. Notice surprise look on opponent's face. Quinn will slam. <laughs> it's so good. Well. I'm going to give it another turn. I'll brainstorm at the end of their turn. I don't want to brainstorm missile land.
Good call, Walker. And thanks for the help, buddy. Oh, yeah. Carpet flowers. <clears throat> um, I'll brainstorm. Pure Dane equals combo 90 plus percent. Oh, equals this. I see what you're saying. Not just like they get it. I gotcha. Um, what are we going to do with this? It'd be sad. This carpet flowers is coming into play. That's for sure. Um, I think I'm gonna put back young pyromancer in this land. Um. Play the Pluto Delta so they don't get the extra mana. They just get one here. We've got double Pyroblast and double Days. M10, does that does that not feel like it was basically yesterday? And it's like so this is so long ago. Alright, no plays. Um We know the top card. No, we don't know the top card. But I'm good with this. But we didn't know the top card. Um Do you need to finish this game? Play the Pyromancer here. I wish it was just a Delver, but... So I could still hold up double Pyroblast, double... Days. The Days is getting worse and worse and worse. Taking down two mana almost guarantees it. If they have it, they'll go for it this turn. Although that Besaju tells me otherwise now. I'm gonna brainstorm end of turn. We make a token. Force will Delver Terry. Uh, we'll put Young Parmancer and Terry on top. Uh, I'm gonna want all of the mana. I can I guess I could add still. Can't counter anything. This is gonna be so annoying. Add a Delver. Seiju is very good. Show and tell can't be countered. Sure, I'll put Terry in. Omniscience. Cunning Wish. That was lucky. <laughs> Force of Will. Alright, so hopefully their last card in hand is just Force of Will.
Oh, they can cast the force through omniscience. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Shared summons. That's for five, so hopefully they just go for it right now. Just go for it. Oh. All right, this random name generator person. VWXYZA648204. Welcome to the Thunderdome. M16, yes. That's exactly what I was thinking after I talked it out loud. I would have loved to have played Fairies when it was the best deck, man. BB deck, uh, though, had a lot of heat at the same Like, that's, that's huge. BB right into... Is this Chalice on one? Blood Moon. Um, just trying to think here if we should still play. There's two islands in the deck. Stealing information for next game is very important. <laughs> uh, so we're going to bring in Brazen Borrowers now. Um... That. Bring those in for Terry's, I think. Do that. Uh, before Blood Braid off, though, Fairies was just not, just best, not even close. Blossom Cryptic, Mistbind, Spellsetter, Mutavolt, Thoughtseize. Excuse me, early morning. It does sound pretty perfect, Wes. Oh, I would love that. That's basically what I... I've been trying to play forever, and it, it's just not good enough right now. Um, this hand's fine. Yeah, I like this hand. It's standard. What? That's crazy. I'm trying to make it work in modern, man. That is nuts to have in, in standard, that's for sure. Throw a Terry out there. That's crazy. <laughs> Trinosphere will counter. And then... We'll waste that. Bang for one. Play the city to back it up. Now what? Trinosphere back? All right. You got it. Can't ponder. We'll attack. Ugh, just really did not want to see a Blood Moon there. <laughs> um, 
I'm gonna hold up Spall Pierce. <clears throat> right? All we want to do is just untap with true name there, and we were good. Good to go. Didn't need any more threats. This thing needs to get to a 5-5 five five before, <laughs> or we can help. We, we do have quite a few outs to this. Um, Spall Pierce hopefully is gonna do a bit of work here before they can get anything going. Ugh, that's so frustrating. Uh Bro, that's a mountain. Uh this thing flies, this thing fly. This thing does not look like it flies. One card in hand, so Pia Karen needs to go the distance. Young Pyro wasn't bad. Play that. You thought Terraman would be on level with Del remember I remember that. It had like two months in the sun where you could not find one. Everyone collected them, everyone was going nuts for them. Um They also thought that um what the hell's that other card? The black one. Uh if a creature died this turn, it's a 3-2 flying death touch. For one, Bone Crusher, Bone. Yeah, this is this is tough. Bone Picker, that's it. So you take a lot of whiffs from our opponent. <clears throat> oh, dead cards in their deck, but it's gonna take a lot of whiffs to get back in this. We ain't dead though. <laughs> now we're dead. Now we're dead. This is just attacking for lethal here. Yeah, very good. Next, has so much synergy. Um, this is fine. Do this. We're on the play. <clears throat> I was not a fan of these. Anybody like these? All of them except for the Amon Cat ones, right? <clears throat> yeah, they're not definitely not my favorite. Yeah. The um Kaladesh ones are, are not my favorite either, but they're fine. Let's do it. Flip it force will sure. Bang for three, no land. Expeditions are, that was by far their best. I did so very well with that. Um, yep. Dress resolves. I don't know what they take here, probably the force. 
or the stifle. This is Storm. Does Stifle... I think it does, yeah, that's why they took it. Uh, but Stifle stops the Storm trigger. Beardane. Alright. That's so good. Um, uh, the chain lightning. An extra three. God, when you're playing a deck full of just counter spells and, and bolts, like, get in the game pretty quick. Brainstorm, yeah. I'm very happy to see. <clears throat> True Name Nemesis make it back into list now that Oko's banned. Nice. Third days. Gonna be tough to convert on that. I don't even have the land for the second one yet. <laughs> Hopefully, we can defend this turn and then. Draw a bolt? Oh, I guess, uh, you scratch, so... Ooh! Excuse me. Um... What do we want in here? I think Blood Moon's probably fairly good. I'm gonna bring that in. And don't think I want anything else. Got a true name. You do some of these. For mod script? For what? For passion flames? I don't know, I don't even, well, it looks like a storm deck to me, but I'm not sure. I think... Right, they have a bayou as well. I'll leave it like this to like figure out exactly what's going on, and we'll... Yeah, it's probably look like Storm to me, but I'm not. Yep, yeah, could be for Decays exactly, or just the Veils in the sideboard too. Um, I'm logging this. This is finish. We'll keep it. I'd like to keep them off mana for a little while, so why don't I just put back uh, like a Brainstorm. No, you don't. I'm gonna put back a chain lightning. <laughs> oh no, they've countered our blood moon already. Oh no! <laughs> That's so funny. I uh, will ponder here. I love these ponder arts. It's so nice. If it's storm, probably is. Um, they have a ton of basics. You think so? Uh, I want these. So I'm gonna go. Uh, I don't have many counter spells here, at all. I want Terry last ponder Delver. No shuffle. So at least we have a threat. Then we can dig for counter spells after. Hopefully this wasteland. Can go a bit of distance. <laughs> I 
Right, four legacy, yeah. I see what you're saying. <clears throat> well, I'm gonna brainstorm here. Um, we'll put... Mm, pyro... Definitely want Terry back. More than four is a ton. More than four is a lot in modern as well. Um, I'm gonna put just Ponder and Terry back. That's fine. And then I'm gonna fetch this. And we'll grab. Let's grab a Snoke Rhode Island for now. Play us a Delver. All right, Misty goes for Underground Sea. Black for Thought Seas, you got it. I think they're gonna take the Ponder here. Take the Blood Moon. It surprised me, I didn't think that they were that dead to, to Blood Moon there. a big spell to have to like counter as well uh stifle yes it would bolt for this, this is for four color wow um well, I'm going to play the Pyromancer. I'll waste the Valk, or the Underground Sea, sorry. Edge of Autumn. Yep. Crazy card. This is a wild card. Duress, yeah, there comes the stifle. Teps, what's Teps? Oh, the epic storm. T-E-S, yeah. I gotcha. I'm picking up what you're throwing down, Wes. I don't know. I'm gonna try and slam this true name. Horse back up, yep. All right, taking a lot of lands out of his out of his hands. This Terry Terramander is so good late. What you think, what you think about when you born into a fire? The let him burn the all five five for two mana. Five five flyer for two mana. It's pretty good. Oh, it's for each instant sorcerer card in your graveyard. One, two, three. Uh-oh. I thought it was one, I, think it, I thought it was a delve. Not as good. Not a big fan of this card. This is one, two, 
three. Still costs five. Oh, that's not gonna work. Might as well add one more. All right, they drew by you. These is probably. I, I don't know. They got to They got to tell us before. <laughs> <I'm done. laughs> maybe, maybe it's some kind of blue depths deck. I don't know. Um, sure, Carper Flowers. No. <laughs> it's too bad you can't just like draw a card from your opponent's deck. <laughs> to see what's going on. Uh, this sounds great. Aether Vial. Yup. A damn right it is. Just me what? <laughs> it's just you. I'm <laughs> doing it over and over and over again. Um, we'll play our threat here. We don't like our chances against Aether Vial. Same guy. Watch he make the same mistakes time. Why couldn't we do that better? Um I'm gonna daze this. I was hoping that's what the issue was. Oh, we do. Snow covered mountain. Nope. Oh. We'll be different uh, with each play of the video. <laughs> what is this? Core Nomad Soldier. The next one damage we dealt to is dealt to target creature you control instead. And Cavern on Wizards. Alright. What are we doing here? Reveal days. Sure. It may have, it, you're right, it may have been Doomsday. That's not a bad idea, actually, either, Wes. It's probably, you're probably right. In that case, we had a lot of turns against them, though. Like, that was a ton to go through. Um, well, none of these are any good. Problem is with Cavern and Violet, I'm not gonna be able to counter anything. I think you're right. It might have just missed. We did take him off, like man, at, at very awkward times for them. If it was Doomsday, but I didn't see any uh, any dark rituals. So maybe they just were missing the dark ritual. Lightning Bolt's a good draw there. Don't know what this deck is. Now, if you could pick this one out, Wes, <laughs> I'd be impressed. <laughs> what the hell's the, the plan with this? Only ritual if they had Team's Day, but I still don't know. Yeah. I that's my best guess, but... They continue to do nothing here. A lot of true name. Core. Cheese target player.
What are they waiting for? <laughs> Just core tribal? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Man. <laughs> what a deck. Uh, we're gonna bring in a Braids. Those are gonna be great. Um, I feel like I want Blazing Volley as well for that one core. I don't know if it hits the rest of the deck, so it's probably not a great idea to bring that in. But, we'll do that, and I think, uh, maybe Brazen Borrowers could do a little bit better. It's used for a combo. It's got to be still some kind of combo. Hard combo. Uh, we'll take out the true names. A little bit slower than Brazen Borrowers. And I think I'm going to take out, uh, Terry or two. Um, Stifle's probably not very good either. I put a Terry back. Yeah, I think that's fine. Uh, Days, Force Negation, Force of Will are all going to be tough to convert on. But. Breakfast? Maybe it's, um, Cephalid Breakfast? Is that what it is? Confirmed? This is fine. There's so much creature kill in it. We'll see. I liked our last start though, the... Remove their lands part of it was, I think, very good. That is the combo? So what's the combo? How does it work? Uh, let's say the rebel and going for the hard hardcore try. I don't, I don't think so. <laughs> uh, Stoneforge. Oh, let's brainstorm a response here. Hmm. Yeah, I'll daze that. So the sand is now awkward for us, but. We'll put Young Pyromancer on top, and we just Blazing Volley on top, then I'll daze that. Hide the fact that we only have one land. Uh, another Stoneforge Mystic. I could let it resolve, Nomad target. Infinite than Dread Return Oracle. Oh, it's an Oracle deck. Okay. Gotcha. Um, they let this resolve. Then what do they get? They just have... This is just on one card. Um, give the deck there, though. Ugh, this sucks. Uh, we're gonna put you and you on top. Mm -mm 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 -mm. No good. Uh, Stone Forges, they get what? Jitte, Batter Skull, Shuko, which is. Oh. Another Stoneforge, oh my god. Gotcha. Three Stoneforges in a row. Um, we're gonna play a Terry here. We have one, two, three, four, five. Infinitar. 
So the Nomad, Sephage Illusionist becomes a target spell ability. Put top three cards of your library in your graveyard. Shoot my thing. Discard Cabal Therapy, that's pretty good. Ah, uh, yep. I'm gonna assume they take Brainstorm here. Yeah. Alright, let's draw our land. That would be wonderful. Oh yeah, I forgot we had Brazen Bar on top. Forgot about that. So you dump your... Up the graveyard. And then you Dread Return. Okay, I see. It sounds cool. Uh, Cabal Therapy. Boo. Uh, probably gonna name Lightning Bolt here. But... Young Pyromancer. It's cool to see, man. I love, love seeing these decks. They were saying, um, ugh. I'm wizard again. Um, I was listening to um, Leaving a Legacy podcast, and they were saying that the last challenge had more different style decks, or the same ish, different style decks, like um, in the last challenge, than interesting, <laughs> than, uh, than they had playing the challenge the um in the oko in the last oko meta the morris was 45 different type of decks versus the like 45 to 50 ish that actually like entered the challenge with oko that's <laughs> pretty wild no those words made sense i think that they did You should use Suture Ghoul with Anger to win. Like Anger of the Gods? Or Anger with Haste? Right. Oh my god, this hand. 3, 6, 9, 12. And Wonder for Flying? Anger gave Haste and Wonder gave, gave Flying? Brainstorm? I'm going to want to get rid of some of these lightning bolts because they do have Cabal Therapy. <clears throat> so if they play a creature... They know about Lightning Bolt and Blazing Volley, so very likely that they name one of those two. Uh, core. Yeah. So I'm going to bolt here now to try and get them to name... Uh, Blazing Volley instead. They know that they connect with a card. They did. Joke's on you, man. It was around the time World Gorger. World Gorger Dragon got. It's World Gorger Dragon do again. I remember that card being banned and looking at it, you're like, what? I'll uh, pass again. They're down to one card in hand. This is a weird matchup. Like, weird, weird what we're doing right now. When I just exile everything in control. Oh, okay. Play Batter Skull. <laughs> we'll bolt here. And we're gonna daze that. <laughs> Whoa, what is, a, what is this matchup? Man, what is this matchup? That <laughs> play, play batter skull days. <clears throat> uh, okay, I see what you're saying. That you can do some weird stuff in Legacy, eh? Future land card you own from outside the game. Reveal Uro. Uh oh. I actually need just like blue card. One, two, three. They can't double cast it. Ugh. Their fourth lightning bolt. 
Oh, blue card would have been. I guess not that good. Yes, you get in a row. Ugh. We're so close. Eighth ball, sure. Um, green, green, blue, blue. So I need this to connect here to take him off double green, hopefully. Hopefully they don't have another green mana. Fuck. I don't think we can beat in a row. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We have in our sideboard for this. Tormod's Crypt. I guess Tormod's Crypt is probably fairly good in this. Surgicals would be great. So, we've got some extra sideboarding to do. Finally got our other land. Uh, 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 okay, so surgicals. Uh, does Tormod's Crypt do anything against this deck? Uh, yes it does, because it's a Thassa's Oracle deck. Let's bring these in. Um, Stifles are actually good, because they're going to hit the Oracles. So, we don't want, wait, so where do we take out of here? Spell pierces, we get rid of this blazing volley now, we in for cheesy cheese? Sure, last one, why not? Why not? They do have like five colors, right? It's a lot. Game with that. Work bolt sorcery, yeah. Take that out. I think I want to take out chain lightning as well. And maybe one Terry. This is what we're into. Now we've got a way better plan. Um, this hand is fine. Delver, Surgical, Daze, Stifle. Yeah, I like this hand a lot. What did we get here? Days? Sure. Flip that for a days. Happy about that. Really fetching for Tundra. Swords. Well, I'm gonna daze that and just show them. The days. The days. This as well. I'm gonna surgical 
Surgical Stone Forge. See what's going on. I want to do it on their turn just in case they have Force Negation. I'm good with that. Three more in library. They have the Illusionist. <clears throat> Days, couple of Narc Amoebas, and a GTA. Uh, they have one more Swords in the deck. Javiles. Should return. Okay. And the Oracle. Uh, perfect. All right, so they still have uh, Cephalusionist, Days, two Narcomibas, and the GTA. Their hand is not great. They drew at least one uh, Narc while they got, they got railed this game. I think that's that's really tough. Um, the Illusionist takes two. They only have one mana, so I'm going to play this, and we're going to hit... Uh, we'll go for the white mana. Sometimes Delver can be so oppressive, man. So oppressive. What do they draw here? Must have been a land if they're really thinking about it. This deck is sick, but <laughs> like, look at how we lost the second game was just Bro, like how good is that card? It was just nothing we could could have done against it other than counter it, but by that time it was like late in the game. They had like 12 cards in the graveyard. They could have done it like three, four times. Uro is bonkers. Three two with Izzy Delver. Well done, team. Good job.